Hello YouTube, this is Mr. Shadow Link here, and today we're going to be talking about what's happening this week in Kingdom Hearts Cross Japan. Uh, so, let's get started. I know I did an episode yesterday and the day before yesterday, but it's anniversary, so they're starting to, like, unleash more events. And they're significant enough to the point where I won't hold them off until Sunday, like I normally do. Uh, so, yeah, let's get started. So, there is a... Uh, there is a high score challenge with older medals again. So if you guys don't know what these medals do, um, or anything like that. So currently they're they are currently reprinting uh, in this high score challenge. Sora and Beast, Sora Punchy, Donald and Goofy, and um, Ventus, um, Armored Ventus. And what Sora and Beast does is that for four gauges, he is the speed version of uh, Terra B alongside Donald and Goofy. So they're both uh, the speed and magic variants of Terra B. So they do the exact same thing. And yeah. Uh, It says right here, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I can actually tell you guys what are the, all these medals are actually plus 21, so it's like the previous reprint, high score challenge, so, uh, oh yeah, they're, the high score challenge reprints, the, the, ah, crap, I, f I forget what they're called, um, the the bonus medals are uh, Illustrated Kyrie, Illustrated KH2 Sorum, 0.2 Mickey, uh, Axel, uh, HD Axel, HD Roxas, Maleficent Dragon, Chain of Memory Sora or Sora Illust Illustrated Sora version B. Uh, Illustrated Halloween Town Sword, Illustrated Roxas, Illustrated Xemnas, Xenor Evanitas, Dark Riku, Key Art 1, Key Art 4, Key Art 7, I think. It's, uh, yeah, it's 7, Key Art 7. Um, Illustrated Shion, what's her face? Ursula HD, and then World of Chaos are the uh, medals and these are all plus 21 so if you guys have that you could quite possibly make a full team but yeah I mean it's up to you guys right there so yeah that's pretty much it so if you guys are able to do that you're gonna be able to score high enough if you're lucky and all that good stuff and because second anniversary like I said it's coming uh, just like last year there's a lead-up event so from starting today up until next Wednesday for if you live in the continental US around that time uh, you got we're gonna be getting um, so up until uh, August 27th to August 31st we're gonna be getting a countdown uh, event so each day you're, we're gonna have to defeat the gold, uh, the golden mushrooms, and if we defeat it, we can earn Mickey and brooms. We can earn brooms, so that's actually pretty nice. That's pretty nice of them actually, and all that good stuff. So yeah, and then there's also a special reprint campaign. So for fifteen thousand jewels, you're able to get two premium medals, one upright, one downright, one reversed, and you're also getting five VIP coins. Uh, my recommendation is don't pull in this banner. Uh, the previous one is actually a lot better than this one, in my honest opinion. Uh, all right, you may be saying, but we get to boost the premiums. But yeah, these premiums are also ones that come around often uh, I've seen key art 7 come back like 
three times or so. Sora come back a whole bunch of times. Roxas come back a whole bunch of times. Mickey come back. Uh, Kiart 4. All these are coming back often and frequently enough to the point where this doesn't matter. Freaking, uh, what's his face? Dark Riku just came back a while, like a little while back with a taboo, even a stat boosted guaranteed variant of it. That's how I got mine. Xehanort Venetus, they're eh. Like, a lot of these mills, although they, they are still good, they come back at later dates. Yeah, sure, you're, you're not... Uh, yeah, sure, they're super cheap, but you're not getting anything guaranteed that could help you change. That's what I'm trying to get. These are good if you're able to pay for it or you... If you pay for your jewels and you know you have enough money to go through anniversary. These are pretty much just to make people pull out of desperation. These, these, this banner is not that great of a banner. The Marluxia EX one was a good banner because you had Larxene and then you also had Marluxia EX as a bonus. So if you guys were able, lucky enough to get it, you guys had a game changing medal either way. This one, it's not really the same. All of these are either a little bit past their time in the light, limelight, or they're like really good for certain metals. Like for example, this fit dragon. I think people still use her if you have double attack. If you guys don't have double attack, there she's really not useful. And even then, she drops her HP down. World of Chaos. Uh, I figure what he does. I think World of Chaos. World of Chaos. Oh yeah. Yeah, he, he increases your magic attack by two tiers for two turns. Uh, I, there's We already had medals like the HD Drive Form medals that did the exact same thing, but for three tiers for two turns. So, as you guys see here, although they may look good, it's not really worth it. Because you also have Illustrated Zemnis, Illustrated... Um, uh, Shion and then HD Axel, alright, and as well as uh, Illustrate Kyrie and then uh, Halloween Town Sora. If you don't get snap boosted, these are all tier 4. They're and all of these are way past their meta dates. And even then, uh, you guys might be saying, Oh, well, I don't have Illustrate Kyrie, or oh, I don't have like 0 0.2 Kyrie. I want to pull this one because this one's more of a guarantee. Don't pull. If you guys are trying to get a buffer medal or medals like or other things right um, only do it for when you know for a freaking fact that you're gonna because Kyrie's already overshadowed unless you unless you are unlucky enough and not be able to pull her zero point to Kyrie is better in every definition of the way uh, and then, uh, then uh, Halloween Town Sora, he was never really any useful. <laughs> so there's that. Um, Chain Memory Sora, uh, his time also kind of passed already. Same as World of Chaos, same as uh, uh, Key Art 4. Key Art 2 is actually still very useful. Oddly not Key Art 1, I mean, it's still very useful. These two are still kind of useful, but it, it depends if you have double cast on them or not. Roxas is actually still very useful. Kind of depends though. Again, there's if you don't have lingering wall or any plus anything that gives you more than plus three, then yeah, that's good. And then Mickey he's still he's still extremely useful. But other than that, for the reverse metals, really the only ones useful are still Maleficent Dragon, Dark Riku, and then Kai Posted HD Roxas. Every other ones are kind of meh. So in reality, although yes, for new players this might change their game a lot. Just don't. <laughs> the fifteen thousand jewels are for two premiums are not all that worth it, especially since like the pool is kind of a little bit outdated. Metals now, where they release better metals already. If this were to come out like two, three months ago before like a lot of things, then I, was, then I would say, yeah, go for it. But 
they're really not all that great. Uh, but yeah, um, enough about my ramblings. This has been your host, Mr. Shalink here, and that video as well. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later.